Hey there, my name is Shafi Yunus and in this tutorial we are going to create a new IntelliJ IDEA project for Kotlin. Okay, so to get started, launch your IntelliJ IDEA and click here on new project. Here you have many templates for a new project. I'm going to choose Kotlin. I will name this project Hello for Kotlin like that. And I'm going to choose just a console application. And for the build system, I'm going to choose Maven. And lastly, you can choose an SDK. Basically, you have to install GDK in your machine. All right. Next, create next. Now you have to test, you have to set the test framework for this project. I'm going to use JUnit4 and click finish. Let's the project build and sync. And as you can see, we have the project here. So by default, the Maven project create a simple file here. It creates two structures, one for the test and one for the main. And here in the Kotlin, you will have the first file. Let's delete this file in order to create it from scratch. Okay, now to create a file in Kotlin, just double click on that, create a new add Kotlin file. Okay, I'm going to choose file and not class. This, in contrast to Java, you can't create a method without creating a class. But in Kotlin, you can create a Kotlin file, basically any file. Let's name it hello. It's hello.kt file. And here, I'm going to create a function main. Okay, to create a function, we're going to use the keyword fun. We will learn about functions more in this playlist. But for now, you have to understand that functions have the keyword fun. Or let's just create a main function. Create a main keyword and you will see two live templates will pop up main and main A. Main have no arguments and the main A has an argument from array of strings as in Java. Okay, and to launch it, let's just print something. In Java, we used to do system of art print line and here in Kotlin, let's do just print like that. And here I'm going to print Hello world from the other side. Okay, in order to run the application now, just click here, run, here we go. Our application runs successfully. Now you know that your project is initialized good. Now, in order to test that your tests are also set up correctly, just create a test here. Let's create a test class, it's called just test. And here inside this test class, Let's use alt with insert to insert the test function. I'm going to use JUnit4. I'm going to name this nothing, test nothing. I will delete its body and write like that. You are supposed that the test should pass. Good. Now you know that your project is successfully initialized. You can start using Kotlin in any way. I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching this video and see you in the next upcoming videos.